Hey everybody, Coach Weimer's back with 3Sport. Today, our first drill we're going to look at is the center quarterback exchange. We have millions of offenses in football today, uh, many, many more of them getting away from the center quarterback exchange. But we've got to learn that as quarterbacks. If we're going to coach a football team and be a part of uh, you know, getting a play run correctly, we've got to put the quarterback under center. So let's talk about this a little bit today. I know one quick thing, and everybody always asks me this question. When our quarterback puts his hands up underneath the center, what should it look like? All right. And essentially what we want to do for most right-handed quarterbacks, let's take a look at these two right here. Carson's going to give us a hand to, to make it look like the center's tail end. Brock here is going to put his right hand up and really flex and bow his wrist up underneath the center's tail end. All right, so he can push up in there, aligning his middle finger kind of along with the crack line of the center's tail end and be able to push up and out with that, okay? The second hand will be aligned with the first according to what kind of center that we have. Now, in most cases, the ball is going to come in at an angle like this with the laces coming to the quarterback's finger, okay? A, what I call a three-quarter snap. So Karsten will push down and Brock will push up so we can have our so-called camp snap here, okay? Our camp cadence is go, all right? Our, our three-sport cadence is go. So when Brock says go, Karsten will flip that ball right up to his hands and put these laces right in his fingers. Let's take a look at that real quick. Say go, Brock, eyes up. There you go. All right, just like that. And then we're gonna snap it with as much force as possible, be able to bend over, all right, and get where that center is right down there. Okay, let's look at the hands here. Colin's gonna put his hands up underneath Webb, okay? And he's gonna, now Colin's left-handed, so he's gonna have his left hand up, pressing up with his left hand and his middle finger. And you can see his right hand is hanging right down here. Open hands. We want those things open, flexible, pliable fingers to be able to catch that snap, okay? In this position here, Webb's gonna give a three-quarter snap, okay? So he's gonna turn the ball with the laces down pointed to the left. He's gonna serve that ball up to Colin's hands where those laces go right up to Colin's fingers, okay? So he'll hold the ball, gripping it as tightly as he can, tip the nose up a little bit, and be able to deliver that ball right to the hands. He'll throw it right up to his tail end and be able to step at the same time. Okay, take a quick look at it. Bang. Go. All right, just like that. Now this time Webb's gonna snap it. He's gonna snap it really firm and fast and take a step forward. This guy's never played center before, so this is awesome. Okay, a three-quarter snap. Let's do it here on go and do it loud and get after it. Here we go. Go. There we go, good, just like that. Now, quarterbacks, we have to push that center out with our hand while we'll be taking a snap, a step, excuse me, and we'll be talking about that here in another second in another drill, okay? Let's do one more snap here. And this time you're seeing a lot of centers and offenses holding the ball as the center with the point down, okay, with the laces out like that and snapping that ball to their tail end like that. If that's the case, the quarterback will need to have his hands, thumbs together, split apart. We're not going to stagger the right hand or the throwing hand on top. We're going to put two hands spread out across the tail end of the center so we can catch the ball just like that. Okay, let's take a look at that here real quick. So hold the end of the ball, Webb. There you go. Out like that. Colin will get up underneath there, hands spread out, and bang. Go. Good. Fundamental things win football games. Fundamental things make you better at playing football. We climb up underneath the center as the boss, and we want to take that snap and be firm, working with our center all the time. You want to be good at the exchange. Get your centers, get them out on the field before every practice, during, after. Let's get the quarterback center exchange so we can go make a play.